Hi, I'm Eric J. Barkman, and welcome to the first episode of Crossover Corner, my new vlog where I take suggestions from various people about two series that would be difficult to do a crossover, or maybe even just, you know, amusing, funny, whatever. People can suggest any two series they want, and then I figure out how you would do a uh, crossover between them. So, I have all the suggestions I've gotten so far in here, with a few exceptions. Basically, I decided not to do any video game related crossovers for this first episode because that entails a bit more that and you're not just figuring out story but you're also figuring out like gameplay stuff and I thought if I did that people might think oh that's just what the show is about but no. So in future episodes video game stuff will be included as well just for this first episode I decided not to. So I'm drawing a random one and what do we have? No. Oh. Uh, Terminator and Alien. This was suggested by my friend uh, Sean Larkin. So this is actually a bit of an easier one to do. In fact, there has technically been a crossover between these two plus Predator because everyone's familiar with like the Alien movie franchise and the Predator franchise and knows that they crossed over with the Alien vs. Predator franchise. What a lot of people don't know is that prior to the movies, they first crossed over in the comic books. And there has also been a comic that was Alien vs. Predator vs. Terminator. So they have crossed over before. I have not read the crossover. I did look it up. But that's kind of a crossover between the Alien vs. Predator franchise and the Terminator franchise, not just the Alien franchise. And also my idea for crossover would go in a bit of a different way, which is why I decided to include it anyway. So anyway, Terminator is of course, for those unaware, at some point in the future the machines take over, start hunting down humans, and they create the Terminators, which are these kind of androids. They look like humans on the outside so that they can like infiltrate and terminate people. And then of course another component of the franchise is time travel. In the future, the human resistance is led by John Connor, so the machines figure out a what method of time travel. They send Terminator back in time to kill Sarah Connor, John Connor's mother, before he was ever born. When that fails, they send another Terminator to kill John when he was a kid, and various other times throughout his teenage years and such. The franchise has had five movies. I've seen four of them. I haven't seen the fourth one. So the first three and the fifth one, and a TV series spinoff that came out between the third and the fourth one, I believe. I've also seen that. Although that one, it ignore. Well, I mean, it kind of it used time travel to basically undo the events of the third one. Alien franchise, of course, set in the future, also sci-fi. Basically, it's with aliens. They like lay their eggs inside you, and then you have your chest bursters that come out from that killing people and then like and then they take on some of the characteristics of whoever they burst from the chest of. There have been six movies plus I believe two of the Alien vs. Predator spin-off and yeah and also both series have had various comic books some video games and such. I have not actually seen any of the Alien movies. I own the first one but I have not actually watched it yet. A friend of mine gave it to me because I guess he got a newer version with more special features and such, so he just gave me the DVD. So I'm gonna watch it eventually, but I am familiar with the franchise, I've read a few of the comics. So the way I would do crossover between these two series, I would set it during the Terminator future, so like when the machines are taken over, what I would have is an alien winding up on Earth, not sure how, possibly it's on some spaceship that crashes, Possibly it's found in some ancient ruin because it's been here for like thousands of years. I think that's like how the Alien vs. Predator movies go. I'm not entirely certain. But like, either way, this alien ends up uh, on Earth. The machines find it and decide to try weaponizing it against uh, humans. So the machines, they end up getting one or more aliens into heavily populated human area and starts wreaking havoc. Probably the first settlement that this happens at would probably just get wiped out, like, no survivors. From there, what I would have 
the resistance finds out about it, like they lost contact with a the settlement. They go in and investigate, find this uh, alien uh, xenomorph, or whatever. Yeah, the xenomorphs are what they're what they're actually called, I guess. Several members of the team get killed, but they do manage to kill a xenomorph. But then what happens is they realize the machines probably have more of these. So they send a team to infiltrate a machine base where they find that, yeah, the machines have been growing a lot of these xenomorphs, they're keeping them locked up until they're ready to, you know, send them out. The space is, of course, also filled with Terminators. This is probably a suicide mission. They die. Maybe one or two makes it out. But after, and possibly because of, freeing the xenomorphs, so the xenomorphs go start attacking. Big epic battle between the xenomorphs and the terminators. Other members of the resistance would probably be outside the base and basically be killing anything that tries getting out. So you just have the big, so they're keeping the battle contained in here trying to make sure Terminators and Xenomorphs wipe each other out completely, or at least as completely as possible. This is a fairly easy crossover to do. There are multiple ways to do it, but that, that, that would be my way of doing it. Um, let me know in the comments down below how you would do a crossover between them, and also what kind of crossovers you'd like to see me tackle in the future. I have still a lot left to go, but I'm always open to more suggestions, more ideas, anything you think will be difficult or even just cool. Because this one wasn't super difficult. It's probably the easiest one in there. Also, don't forget uh, to follow me on uh, Twitter, Eric underscore J underscore Barkman. Like this video, uh, share it, subscribe here on YouTube if you aren't already. Uh, you can also become a patron on my Patreon patreon.com slash Eric J Barkman. I stream on Twitch. Uh, you can go check that out. Uh, Twitch.tv slash Eric Barkman. On Twitch, I do both writing and gaming streams. And you can, also, if you want to see my writing, you can go to my Tumblr, ericbarkman.tumblr.com. Two series on there, Simple Complications, which is a daily series. It started opening up with university students, slice of life type series. Same characters now, plus a few others. But now it's like sci-fi, action adventure, out in space stuff because that's just the way I roll. My other series, Chrono Hustle, it's all about time travel. Uh, so go check those out, and yeah. And... See ya.